meteorologist Brian Nisnanski. Over the weekend, we turned the page to March, so we actually came to an end when it comes to record keeping for the winter season. Now, we ended up being in second place as far as the coldest winters on record. We fell shy of first place uh, by 0.6 degrees. The uh, record still stands from 1903 to 1904, so that's still over 100 years since we've been uh, this cold in northeastern Wisconsin. So, again, we didn't break the record for coldest uh, winter on record, but we got pretty darn close. Now, this morning, again, it is dangerously cold. Uh, wind chill advisory in effect across northeastern Wisconsin. Uh, wind chills anywhere from 20 to 30 below zero, but we got calm winds out there this morning mainly. So, really, it's the actual temperature, not necessarily the wind chill uh, that's bitter cold this morning. It's 21 degrees below zero in Green Bay. Yes, 21 degrees below zero. The old record was 10 degrees below zero for a record low temperature this morning. Eight below zero, the current wind or current temperature in Appleton, but I guess there is a, a wind chill of 25 below zero. Winds out of the north northwest at nine miles per hour. So all it takes is a little bit of a breeze, and again, you'll get that wind chill. Temperatures across northeast Wisconsin, it's 18 below in Oconto, 21 below again in Green Bay, 10 below in Oshkosh and Chilton, 11 below zero in Fond du Lac. Across the Midwest here, I guess it could be worse elsewhere. 30 below zero, the current actual temperature in International Falls this morning. The temperature trend, the high temperatures, the next seven days, they're on the way up, but just not much. 20 for the high tomorrow, 21 on Wednesday, 24 on Thursday, 28 on Friday. That appears to be the warmest day on our seven day trend, and uh, 20 uh, this coming Saturday. Let's go through the forecast highlights. Again, dangerously cold out there this morning. Another round of snow moves in here later on tonight. More on that in a second. Second, and then temperatures will be way behind again through the rest of the week. Here's your Midwestern satellite and radar, and you can see there is the snow. Here it is across North Dakota. This is going to be a fast moving Alberta clipper that brings snow to us later on tonight and into tomorrow morning. So, in the meantime, high pressure is in place, and we'll start the day with lots of sun and high pressure, just brutally cold out there. Clouds will increase through the day today and into this afternoon, but your afternoon and evening commute will be fine. It's uh, late tonight and tomorrow morning that we'll start to see the snow, and this is 9 a.m. to Tomorrow morning, so we still could have some snow around by then, but shortly after then, uh, we'll start to see the snow taper off just to a couple flurries. And as we head into uh, Tuesday night and Wednesday morning, here comes another clipper, but this one looks to be uh, diving south of the area, still throwing a chance of a few snow showers in the forecast Tuesday night and Wednesday. As far as the snow overnight tonight, looks like about one to three inches of total snow for most of us, maybe a little bit less down towards Oshkosh, Fond du Lac, Sheboygan. Your forecast for today, mostly to partly sunny skies, a high temperature of 13, still very cold out there for tonight. The snow arrives again, I would say around 9, 10 o'clock tonight and into tomorrow morning. Again, snow likely one to three inches of snow possible. And here's your 10 day, Northeast Wisconsin's only 10 day forecast, 20 uh, for the high temperature on Tuesday as we head up to 21 on Wednesday and then by uh, Friday up to around 28. So still way below uh, the normal of 34. Uh, but I guess there's a little bit of hope things will yeah. get a little bit better. We have some trickling up numbers. <laughs> yeah. But I am so sick of sitting inside. I want to say yeah. I'm just going I stir am get, crazy with this. Cold. I sure am. I mean, especially now that we've moved to March, you start getting your hopes up yeah. a little bit. But as of right now, there's really no sign of this coming to an end. Uh, just an epic winter. Yes. All right. When we come back, Good the word. queen of day.